Coating process include pre-processing, check mold thickness, conformal coating, inspection and repair, curing, and overnight sitting. The conformal coating operation will be conducted in a controlled environment with precise temperature and humidity parameters to maintain the integrity of the conformal coating. In order to avoid conformal coating overflow onto the other side during the coating process, we will apply protective stickers to the screw holes on the board. Furthermore, for any DIP components with holes, we will seal the gaps with silicone to prevent any substance from leaking in. In order to avoid the conformal coating from being drawn into the component due to capillary action during the coating process, we will pre-coat the component with a ring of silicone to create a barrier. Before we start the actual coating process, we're going to do a trial run of the conformal coating spray on a copper plate. We'll then measure how thick the coating is to make sure it's the right thickness. If it is, we'll use these same settings for the rest of the coating job. Initially, compressed air will be used to remove any dust from the surface. Subsequently, conformal coating will be dispensed onto the board following a predetermined path. Once the conformal coating has been dispensed onto the board, operators will refer to the work instruction to conduct a visual inspection and manually fill in any missed spots. The board will be passed through an oven to accelerate curing, which takes approximately 5 minutes. Finally, the board will be positioned on a rack and allowed to sit overnight to ensure complete curing of the conformal coating. The subsequent coating process will be carried out on the opposite side the following day. Once both sides of the PCBA have finished the coating process, the conformal coating operation is complete. 